What's going on everybody? It's Tyler here. Today I will demonstrate how to enable hot reloading inside your Electron and TypeScript project. So there are only a few things we need to get uh, live reloading enabled with TypeScript and Electron. Um, they are, we have two packages we're gonna need. One is concurrently and one is Electron-reload. So I'm gonna leave this on screen right now if you wanna copy these down. What we're basically gonna wanna do is run npm install dash dash save concurrently and I already have it installed, but basically this package will allow us to run multiple processes in the command line at the same time. And lastly, we're gonna install npm uh, install electron-reload. Now this package will allow us to hot reload electron applications. So what does this mean? Well, basically in the index.ts file, typically if you made a change in here, like say I wanted to make a change that has a comment or something, if I make a change, it now has to be recompiled by TypeScript. And then it, the Electron app has to be re-ran. Now, what this Electron Reload package will allow us to do is actually skip half of that. So we will be able to rerun the code. And in the next step, I'll show you how to actually um, add in the scripts, which is down here, where we'll actually have our concurrently script running. So let me actually show that. Inside of here, I'm going to import Elect, uh, electron reload from electron reload. And this is a function that takes in two parameters. The first one is a directory name. And the second parameter is an empty list of options. You can look more into these options, but I'm just gonna leave them empty by default. So currently this will work for a normal electron application. You'll just be able to hot reload it, make a change, save, whatever. It'll restart the application, which is great. But since we're using TypeScript, we will have to take it one step further. So inside of the package.json file, I already created this development script, but we're gonna actually use that concurrently file. And what this does is concurrently is a package that allows us under the hood to run multiple commands at the same time in parallel. Now what this means is we can run TSC with the flag of dash W, which is a watch commands, which allows us to recompile the TypeScript every single time we run. And the electron dot, which is a start command. It allows us to start the application on the compiled dot uh, index.js file. So with this development commands running concurrently, we can now do something like this, npm run dev. And what this will do is start up concurrently. As you can see, it's starting compilation in watch mode and it's watching for file changes. When I click get version and it says 1.0 and I click OK, it goes away. But what if I want to really quickly test something out, like have two alerts and this says this is a second alerts. Now, when I refresh, you can see it just recompiled. And what that means is if I click this and I click OK, you can see that now this is here. It hot reloaded the application. And this is a TypeScript file. This means it's recompiling that file every single time I make a change. And that is what the TSC-W flag is. TSC with the watch flag basically works with uh, anything. The reason we need concurrently is so we can actually use it with Electron. And that is basically it. If you found this video helpful, please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.